What's up, everybody? Travis. <laughs> See? Travis I here. Do, I know how to do the old one. And the only time I got to intro was in a scrapped episode. We'll try again. I'm gonna, I'm, do, I'm gonna do it right now. Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna cut that because that was bad. Right, I almost on, said Tyrannosaurus Let me. Get, <laughs> I noticed when you hesitated. <laughs> I was like, "What's everybody?" Oh shit! What it's am I happening. gonna do? It's happening. It's happening. Uh, uh, brain fart, brain fart, bro. How'd you always start me? What's up, everybody? Right? Yeah. What's up, everybody? Tyrannosaurus yeah. happy. What's up, everybody? Tyrannosaurus happy and Dilodactyl here. That, I just wanted to do that. The point of getting rid of the nicknames was to not use the nicknames. Well, no shit! I'm just saying the only time I ever got to do the intro was an episode that got scrapped. <laughs> it was the first time we did Little Nightmares and they got scrapped. Oh, yeah. You never got to do that. No. I'll leave it in. Thank you. Just so that you can have that. Thank you. That's, that's all I want. That's the only reason I wanted to do it just now. I didn't it's want the actual intro. Bum, bum, bum. All right. So uh, frustrating. Hold on, let me take my shot, and then we'll we'll get to the Hurry game, guys. Up, move more quickly, or go. Why'd you pour so much? <laughs> you ain't got nowhere to be. Hop along. I have to. No, I don't. I have to be in um. Oh my God, Mumbo's Mountain in a second. What? Oh, Mumbo's Mountain, the first oh. world. You fucking idiot. I thought you said I'm almost mountain. I was like, mountain who? No, I'm not mountain anything. <laughs> not lately. <laughs> my first jiggy. What'd you call me? It's 2017. Oh you can't my just God. say that. Oh. oh, oh man, that reminds me. I was so excited <laughs> when, when we when, Tell me when about I brought it. my Xbox over for Little Nightmares uh -huh. the first time when it got scrapped. Yeah. Uh, obviously. <laughs> it got scrapped for good reason. Yeah, it was but a good thing. That same reason was the only reason I didn't get to intro with. What's up, everybody? What's up? What's up, everybody? What's up, everybody? What's up, everybody? What? Oh my god! Oh my god! <laughs> You're so fucking bad at that. <laughs> See, it's not easy. Let me have this. I did like 30 episodes. Don't take like, this from me. What's up, everybody? Don't Time make me forget. Was here with Dilodactyl and whoever the hell else is in this room. Shut your mouth. Shut your mouth. <laughs> What's up, everybody? And welcome to Little N Words. Is what I was gonna say on Little Nightmares, and people were gonna be like, ha ha ha, how risque. <laughs> how is it risque? Little N Words! I get that, but. Little N Words! <laughs> <laughs> little N Words! Little Walls! Like, oh, remember that time Dylan was talking about Little Nightmares, and he was like, Little N Words! <laughs> What's up, everybody? <laughs> you think everybody can tell we're shit faced? <laughs> <laughs> Let's go. I'm so excited. I'm playing Sing Banjo Kazooie song right with now. The music notes. Dude, I'm so happy right now. I feel now. like these graphics are no better than they originally were. This isn't a remastered version, homie. Is there a remastered version? No, there isn't. Oh. This is this is just a port. Okay, I get that the bear can maybe swim, but what about the bird? Yeah, the, okay, well, like, the, oh, God. Um, the bear does, like, the kick, like, the kicking, okay. and then the the bird does the, like, the long strokes. <laughs> the long strokes, The eh? long strokes, yeah. Uh, so, like, you can, you can cover more distance, but you don't have as much uh, Okay, when I control. worked with the same guy who uh, made the joke about, you know, raining pussy. Yes. Uh, whenever we were close to being finished with a job not like done for the day but the job itself was almost done mm -hmm. he would say we're down to the short strokes now <laughs> the short strokes yeah what is that supposed to mean in, in terms of like sex oh. down to the short strokes sex <laughs> you mean you mean like sexual sex right yeah like when you you know when you're like sexing all over somebody yeah, and you're like, I've sexed a few people barely wearing any in clothes, my day, just like sexing on each other. This one time I was sexing this person. No, -uh. I yeah, oh yeah, huh? <laughs> oh yeah, huh? And uh, and then I raised a puzzle piece over my head. Whoa! And then your bird <laughs> ate it and tucked, away, <laughs> tucked itself away in your backpack. <laughs> my bird. Were ate you a it. bear when you were sexing this person? My bird ate my sex. Yeah. You ever been shit on by a bird? Huh? You ever been shit on by a bird? Not on my person. 
I have. Is that a weird thing to say to you? Not on my person? On my person. No, but I, I think the military is to blame for that. Uh, well, see, it's weird to me because I'm a normal person. I'm, I'm conscious of it when I'm it's I'm a normal said, on my but, person. But it doesn't, uh, like... What do you want? Uh, it doesn't trigger anything over... Is that you... fucking Donkey Kong? What the Diddy hell does Kong? he... What does he want? What did, what did he say he wanted? Is this a cross right now? Whatever. Say words, monkey! But yeah, I was laying on a trampoline with a female that I intended to sex on. And, did, uh, did you sex her good? Uh, did, most of the time, no. No. Well, you should have sexed better. I, I should have. You have to sex, like... You have to sex the best you can. Dude, my phone is blowing up. <laughs> we should not have started this episode. <laughs> <laughs> Keep smoking, bitch. So, <coughs> hey, if your phone wouldn't be blowing up, if we wouldn't smoke, <laughs> you sack of shit. You we didn't smoke! You badass, badass assholes! We did the first episode of Banjo-Kazooie, and you're like, no, Yo, roll into the, roll into the next one. Let's just go. Let's Do just the get next it. one. And Do we're just one. getting it now. Look, backflip up there and get your 2D-ass eggs in this 3D-ass game. <laughs> And let me finish my story about getting shit on by a bird! By a bear or a bird? Bird! A bird? Well, the one with wings! <laughs> Which one has wings? Comment, oh! comment so, below. So I'm laying on a trampoline with this girl that I was trying to sex on. <laughs> and we're laying on our backs, looking up at the clouds. It's all romantical. Right. And uh, I see a, a silhouette of a bird mm. flying very high Sexy. overhead. Sexy. And once the bird was about to leave view, I see a second silhouette sort of materialize out of nowhere the silhouette keeps growing bigger mm -hmm. and bigger and darker and darker and then it splatters across my fucking chest that bird shit on me where at we're on right your across my chest on your chest it splattered up my chest do you know a lot of people pay good money for that that's really weird to me like we've said it i don't know how many hundreds of times on here but different strokes for different folks but that's not a stroke for me that's not a stroke for this folk um yeah People pay to get, like, peed and pooped on. And that is weird. And I, I know most of those, like, out there fetishes have some base in psych psychological whatever, but that one's weird. Yeah, it's a little bit weird. And what's up with tentacles? What's the deal with airline food? What's the deal with tentacle well, porn? Imagine growing up in Asian culture, which we know nothing about. So we can't comment on it, but we're going to do it anyway. Imagine growing up in, in like Asian culture. There's probably something that causes that. Mm, mm. Debunked immediately. Uh, Go what's, for what's it. What's that? Um. Uh, uh, Bourdain. Anthony Bourdain, right? Who? The food guy on Netflix. Oh God, I have no Anthony idea. Anthony Bourdain. Yeah, Bourdain sounds more okay. Not stupid. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, uh, he. It, on his show, you know, it, it's a food show, but he's all about, like, the culture of wherever his food comes from. Right. So, it's more about the people he knows in these countries and, like, their background and all that stuff. And then, it's also about really good food. He's right. a chef. Uh, Dude, good food uh, is oh, so yes. good. Uh, he's, it's, it's crazy how deep the guy is. We'll get into that another time, if I remember. But anyway, <clears throat> um, he met the guy who started tentacle porn. You're shitting me. So it came out of nowhere. It came from this dude who He made, was just like, I want to see um, some tentacles. Is, is hentai only digital, or is that also, like, comic book I'm, form? I'm pretty sure it's 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 all animated. Okay. Wait. Animated as in 3D, or, like, a book? No, like, animated, like, videos. Okay. okay. I'm pretty sure. <coughs> Comment below if what, you know different. What do you call it if it's in a book? Do you know? Like a porno mag for um, us. Do you know what it's called when it's animated? No, because it's 2017. Well, well, that's where the tentacle thing came from. It's 2017. This dude who made like dirty mags in you're kidding you know, some Asian country. Yeah. It was all it was no, all I'm pictures not... like a comic. Yeah, it started. Yeah, that's where it came from. Holy shit. Yeah, th this dude, and he looks like you would imagine he does. Bulls, you're blowing my He's like fucking mind right now. The Asian equivalent of the stereotypical neck beard, but. He must be doing okay in life, because he he's the original, he's the OG tentacle porn guy. He made it happen. Don't remember why. Anthony Bourdain. By the way, you have to stop talking about random shit when I'm trying to learn from bottles, because I keep forgetting the controls. <laughs> the day I stopped talking. Well, it's not my, I mean, it's not your fault. 
But you're you're killing me. I don't give a shit. Keep talking. <laughs> Just keep talking about tentacle porn. No, let's talk about different porn. Let's, let's talk about porn stars. Let's talk about female porn stars this time, and not our male favorites. Porn stars. Our favorites. Not necessarily. Oh. But however, that did have. I was thinking about that when I missed the turn to your house and ended up in Florida earlier. But um. <laughs> Florida. Uh. That's how you pronounce where it. Where was I going with this? Oh, we should start doing like a random porn star shout shout out per episode. We should do a porn cast. What would we talk about? No, no, no. I, I know. In no, I'm positive. I'm positive. Stop it. Resume. You're playing this game. No, I know. We were talking about I just porn, said, let's you do it. idiot. I what just were we said, talking about? I just said, Specifically. Let's, let's do a porn cast. And you said, <laughs> what would we talk about? What specifically? I can talk about porn right now. Yeah, I'll pour you a drink right after you. Yeah, I'm going to need a drink. You're a dumbass sitting in the same room as me. Oh. On a porn cast, we'd probably, you know, if sit you in here. Talk about porn, I will bust this fucking sit in here, here, put the mics up. And start jacking off. Look at the. <laughs> <laughs> it's a porn cast. Like, I don't know. Favorite. Favorite porn stars? Favorite porn stars. Favorite, like, like, that's positions? What we, just, no. Styles? Like, POV? Well, I, no, I, I feel like that would be a little much. Like, that would, that would get a little too weird. Okay. Let's let's do this and then get off of it because I feel like <laughs> this is a rabbit hole you don't want to go down. Yeah, I do not want to go down this <laughs> hole. Uh, I don't want the channel to become uh, smut. So, who do you like to see get fucked on camera? The most. The most. Uh, you know what? I don't have an answer for that. It uh, as far as porn goes, I I like to keep it varied. Flavor of the week kind of guy. Obviously, you have some kind of preference. Okay. Uh, I'll name those who have been my favorites the longest periods of you time. You get two. Two? Two. Okay. okay. Um, if any, <laughs> for those who have been watching for a while, I may have mentioned once or twice that I'm a fan of anal porn. Maybe once or twice. <coughs> uh, so I have to say, like right off the bat, Sasha Gray. My heart was broken when she decided to stop. See, mine wasn't. I, I was, what? I was happy for her. I was proud of her. She made it that big, that fast, doing the crazy shit she did. Like I, she took advantage of porn, whereas porn takes advantage of most porn stars. But see, here's she the, worked the system. Okay. It worked her butt. She was actually in a in a, in a really nice movie with Elijah Wood. Um, so good for her for like. You know what he was thinking the whole time when they were off camera. You've seen the picture though, right? No. There's a picture of them at like about. a red carpet thing. Ah, damn it. There's a picture of them at like a red carpet and they're just kind of like posing together, arm around, arm around, mm -hmm. and um, you can see in his face that he's just like. <laughs> <laughs> he's a little. He, I know what she did. He's a little kid with his arm around a porn star. I know what she did. See. Uh, I'm glad you said that because it reminded me of something that I was thinking about when I missed the turn to your house. Um, Sasha, after she retired... She's a beautiful girl. Yes, not only that. Yeah, she's not like this typical like bunch of makeup. Looks yeah, like she's a about whore. to get railed porn star. She is a legitimately beautiful woman. And she enjoyed what she did yeah. when she was doing porn. Yeah. Well, like, that, that's fine. That's cool. You do what you want to do. But I'm not going to like... After she retired, there was like... There was... um pictures leaked or maybe not leaked maybe they were put out on purpose but she was just she would go to schools and read books to kids you're kidding and it's like one those kids don't know yeah they're not gonna know who yeah, she they is don't know. they know oh that pretty lady came to school and read to us today. and she yeah and she was really not, like i she she wasn't like that's cool and then little red riding hood <laughs> and then little red like riding that. hood she, she, on that. Yeah, she was she wasn't wearing a pig nose and crawling around in heels. <laughs> what, was, what have you seen that I haven't with a pig nose? I can show you later, but... I'm excited. That exists. That wasn't me making anything up. That exists. We're going to do a podcast about pig nose Sasha <laughs> Gray, guys. But, um... But she, <laughs> yeah, she was doing a, just a good thing. And if I'm not mistaken, that's just something she does now. That wasn't a one-off, like, ha, I'm out of porn She legitimately thing. does yeah, nice things. she just things. does that, yeah. Um, that's awesome. And so, anybody who, like... Okay, let me make a very clear distinction. Maybe this is shallow of me. Big name porn stars, like the ones who have made it big, you know, their kids are going to college. Nobody's worried about how much it costs. Those type of porn stars, 
If you look down on them just because they're in smut or porn, you're an idiot. They have families, man. Like, they, they're just doing what... I mean, all of them do, but doing, some of them are in it for the wrong reason. They're doing what they're good at, though. Not even that. Like... Ugh, how much longer do we have? I get, I'm I mean, going I, a long rant. I get what you're saying. Like, there are, there are people out there who are really shitty. Right. But there's also people out there who do that because they're good at it. But, but I mean, at the same time, they're not bad people. There are... I, I hope I'm wrong, but I think there are more people who, if they met Sasha Gray in person, they would suddenly be the most confident person in the world and talk down to her because they've seen her work. Whereas, you know, I'm in the minority because I would worship the ground she walked on. You've helped me so many times. For real. No, you know what? You know what? This is exactly perfect metaphor. Walter White cooking meth. Explain. They're doing what they know how to do because somebody's going to do it no matter <laughs> what. No matter what, there's going to be somebody out, somebody out there who makes meth, somebody out there who makes porn. They're doing it, they're making money, and they're bettering other people's lives because of it. Okay, yeah, okay, I, I see what you're saying, like, both in terms of, like, when Walter White makes meth, it's... He's making money to support his family. Right, he's supporting his family, and, and he's he knows there's, there's nothing in his meth that's going to kill you aside from, you know, He's the meth. providing a product for consenting adults. Right. And they're getting exactly what they pay for. We do not condone the use of methamphetamine. I, I condone it if, as long as Travis you get does hurt. not condone the use of methamphetamine. <laughs> Anybody listening is not going to get their meth from Walter White. <laughs> it will kill them. No, it won't. It's good shit. God damn it! <laughs> <laughs> we do not condone meth. Anyway, now get the get the token. I need the okay, token. So um, I can be a termite. Okay, a better way of looking at it. This has been a really weird episode. Not, not Thanks for tuning in, guys. Not the meth comparison, but... Let us know what you think about porn in the comments below. Back to porn. Hold on. Before this one's done. <laughs> let us know, though. Uh, <laughs> when I lived in Germany, uh, prostitution is legal. They called it... Poop. Really? Yes. Like, 100% legal. 100% legal. No, like... There's, there's no, no bullshit. No bullshit. Wow. Yeah. Um, I think once a month, there'd be, like, a random test conducted by the polis I like surprise let me make sure all these girls are clean you know it, it was almost almost a medical thing so like marijuana almost you're kidding no and not even like medical like not like marijuana like going to CVS that's insane the way they look at but, it is but look, I mean okay let, let me just say this that's exactly what I've been saying for almost five to six years about pot or about prostitution. Pussy. Okay. There's sh there should be regulated yeah, prostitution. Put, put rules in place, but make yeah. Because I can't tell you how many prostitutes I've been caught with. <laughs> <laughs> no, like that. Fuck you. <laughs> Think about it. Think about how many people commit violent crimes because because yeah. Okay. Because they need love. They yeah. need to be loved. Or at least what they think is love. Right. But like. If you could just go out and, and find some kind of outlet, yeah. and it's regulated properly by the government. Yeah. Not to mention the government is making money off of it because of taxes. Like, why are we not... It, it's the exact same thing as marijuana. Like, yeah, yeah. Pe people are stupid on marijuana, but not everybody's stupid on marijuana, and yeah. it helps people, and the government's making money off of it. Why not... Yeah. Why not put things in place to <clears throat> kind of regulate like, it, make way, it happen? The way it was treated in Germany, like, all right, imagine you had a daughter. I'm not condoning illegal prostitution, no. by the way. Anybody I'm saying that. I'm saying that sometimes people people need to get laid, and it's, and, and it's I don't know, it's human nature to want love. I would, you, when you <laughs> said people need to get laid, the first thing that came to mind was like, it would be so much better for someone to just have to pay than to take it. If that makes sense. What do you mean? If somebody needs to get laid, oh, it's shit, better for them switch. to, like, pay for it, legally or not. Like, as far as prostitution goes, not age. But better for them to pay for it than take it for free. Hmm. Because there's, you know, scumbags out there. You mean a rapist. They're, yeah, they're gonna get laid. Okay, well... Better for them to pay. As far as rape is concerned, that's their problem. <clears throat> yeah. you, you shouldn't rape people. Yeah, it's... <laughs> yeah. 
Uh, but I get what you're saying. Yeah. Like, I, I think I think people kind of like shove aside the thought of what it's like to be lonely. Yeah, something we were talking about earlier. It, like, it can really jack you up. It it really it it messes with people. Yeah. There are there are studies that show that people significantly lose their minds. Yeah from being lonely and it's not because they're bad people it's because they're just genetically programmed to feel a certain way yeah. and feel damn, like nobody like, cares will and jack you up if that person who is selling themselves which i don't agree with it i, I just I, I don't think it's right but if you're comfortable with that damn who's to tell you not to it's your body you do with it what you want I'm okay with it in a certain in a context, and which is what I'm trying Ow. to get at. Like what feels like 30 years ago when we started this conversation. Yeah, this has been a long one. Legal I'll, prostitution in Germany. I'll probably edit. <clears throat> um, nah, we haven't really said anything that needs to be edited out. We're condoning prostitution, Dylan. So <laughs> we can't get arrested for that. True that. Uh, Screw it. This is this is deep we're, conversation. We're, we're justifying. Why. This is real. We're explaining why. This is real shit, man. And it's not even like people disagree in any form, other than that's not the way it's always been. That's true. Yeah, it's very true. So it's kind of a stupid law, like pot. Absolutely. It's, it's always been this way. Yeah. But and that's a stupid reason for anything. Look <laughs> at look at crime statistics in countries that have legalized pot and yeah. prostitution. Yeah. I mean, side rant that I'm going to keep short as shit because I really want to get back to legal prostitution in Germany is uh, studies have shown and proven uh, vets with PTSD, like no matter what kind of treatment they get, pot works better. Of course. Every single time. Absolutely. Not only does it work better than whatever treatment they were getting, it just, it just works better in general. I believe like that. Like better than anything, no matter what. Um, anyway. Along with thousands of other things <clears throat> that it helps and treats. Yeah. Uh, well, but we'll, but for we'll, everybody but me. But I mean, but, we'll, we'll get on that um, next I, time on Alexa. Don't breaks. you fucking no! No, okay. <laughs> I'm going to finish this story about legal prostitution in Germany. Do it quick. It's looked at as if their, their daughter, who is a prostitute, mm -hmm. is a nurse. Like, if you're 18 year old or however you're old you're treating need, somebody yes yeah you are getting paid significant money that seems really to smart make to someone's me. life better yeah to make them at least bare minimum and you're physically, consenting yeah bare minimum physically feel better but on top of that you have to have some kind of regulation on top right. of it because, which they do in germany because there are there are thousands on top of thousands of cases of human trafficking where yes. people are being exploited against their will. Yeah. But if you are willing and you just don't, like, some people just don't care. But, I mean, I'm talking, like, that's a, that's a job that, like, these girls' parents are proud of them for. I really hope a young child I don't mean does to say not that, like, stumble so upon weird. this banjo kazooie playthrough. Unless they live in Germany, <laughs> and then they know. Unless, or unless we step our game up and catch up with the times, we're still living colonial over here. Hey, Dylan, you remember that one time I told you I would finish the first world completely? Did you? Yeah. Did you? In one episode. Was this one episode though? I did the tutorial in the first episode, and I finished this one in the second episode. Bravo. Told you, man. Round of applause, everybody. Good job, uh, Travis. Hey, 100 notes, and I got uh, all 10 jiggies plus two jiggies. You really got to find something else to call them. J they're called jiggies. That's mm. a name. I don't like it. We'll see you guys in the next episode. <laughs> we'll talk about sex some more. I know you guys love it because of our Maybe. soothing voices. I'm suddenly not at all horny after I watch this episode. <laughs> Man, I was uh, I was I was gonna I was gonna take care of myself. My, uh, but my then, usual uh, tradition, I get off work. I, my uh, God, I take a shower, I watch an episode of Lex Bros, and then I, uh, and, uh, I fire up some porn. I think I, I'm just gonna take a nap this time. I'd uh, <laughs> say hello to Michelle and the kids. <laughs> and I... <laughs> episode three's coming, guys. We love you. Don't Toodaloo, bust that nut just yet. Toodaloo, motherfuckers. Bye bye. <laughs>